I'm ready to assemble this backpacker ukulele. Have a few tools, have some strings, and this bag of parts. This uke started out as a piece of walnut that was three quarters of an inch thick. And I also added a back, and that's an eighth of an inch thick, also made out of walnut. The first thing I'm gonna install is this little compass. Take a little glue, glue it into the board. I'm next going to install the turnaround with this hardware. The turnaround and the compass installed. And now it's time for the friction tuners. All four tuners are installed. And now it's time for the bridge. The bridge is installed. Now it's time for the strap buttons. I just installed a strap button here at the end and also up here at the headstock. The last thing to do is install these strings. And now it has strings. So that's how I do the final assembly for the backpacker ukulele. If you want to see the build process for something like this from start to finish, take a look at my deluxe travel ukulele video. Something like this is meant for practice and travel, but here are a couple options for someone who wants to amplify it a little bit. For personal practice, I can insert this mechanic stethoscope into the tube bridge. This lets the user listen a little bit better as they play. Another option is this little audio harness. I have a quarter inch jack soldered to a piezo rod, and that's encapsulated in a clear tube. With this, the piezo rod is also inserted into the tube bridge. Quite a few people have asked about buying one of these backpacker ukuleles, so I'm gonna start a waiting list. You can go to the Circuits and Strings blog to sign up for the waiting list. I don't know how many I'll be able to make or how fast I can make them, but this gives me a better way to track people who have interest. Put your name on the waiting list doesn't mean you have to buy one, of course, but it just gives you an opportunity when one becomes available. Thanks for taking a look at this video, and don't forget to check back here, because I got a lot of fun projects coming in the future.